Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. You are seeing this in the same screen that many of you have seen. I just completed my fifth victory track match. So far I've gone, I think three and two. I've won three and lost two. Which I won one and lost two. So I guess I'm on a two match win streak if you want to look at the positives. But I am somebody that usually does three Battlegrounds matches every other two days. Now I'm going to look to do better than that for the Ascension uh, motivation this month. But that's it. That's my main motivation is to get my next, like really my first six star Ascended. And, and yes, it's going to be Hercules and that's boring. And if you want to call me a sellout because I'm choosing the champion I use the most, so be it. I guess I am a sellout. But uh, for those of you who have sent me videos where you've ascended things like Red Hulk or Black Widow Deadly Origin or so many others, like that's really cool. But the topic of this video concerns this. The Elder's Mark limit has cost me so much. And I used to think it was just me. And then I talked to several people behind the scenes and they all said, oh yeah, I've, I've encountered that too. And I, I do appreciate that we get these bonus items, you know. But when I say got it, which I didn't have a choice to do anything else, you'll notice that I'm instantly in the 9,000 Elder's Marks uh, category because I needed to do several Battlegrounds fights. And the irony is I was prepared to do and motivated to do several Battlegrounds fights, but I wanted to do them before I claimed those buy rewards so that I had time to clear the space to not waste. I think I wasted like a thousand elders marks by clicking OK. But unlike the normal, like what they, they should have done was just put it in your in-game inbox. Because then you could claim it when you wanted and not claim it until you were ready. But this is something new and something bad for the game. And that is when you reach a certain point, you just have to claim it to move on. There's no cancel screen. I mean, on one hand, if there's something like a like this six star that I've waited to get in the platinum track. If I wait to claim it, I've got another five days and change. And that'll give me, yes, more units and an energy refill. But also it'll give me a chance to wait to open it on a live stream, which is pretty exciting, especially because when you look at how many, at the time of recording this, seven star shards, I need to open my next seven star. Well, wouldn't you know it, I'm within duplicating a six star from that happening. So I will be able to open it, and I'm sure in the next 24 hours, I'll not only have opened that crystal, but I'll have dropped the video on my channel, which is exciting, assuming you don't get you know your third dupe of OG Spider-Man or something. But in the meantime, like this is new and this is bad because you either have to change it or just do the sensible thing and make elders marks limited to more than just 9,000 because that's not that hard to achieve given the solo and alliance milestones that come with that figure. And I, again, I'm not all in on battlegrounds. I don't do battlegrounds that much and yet I constantly have wasted thousands of Battlegrounds Elder Marks by being limited to 9,000. And 9,000 is also a really random number to limit. Why not make it 15,000, like the amount of glory that we can hoard? And as you can see, I'm at 13,998, right up there also on the limit. But thank God it was a 9,000 or else I wouldn't have been able to claim it or I would have had to spend more that I didn't want to because I try to wait each week to be responsible. And yet you don't have that option with the Battlegrounds uh, new buy system that makes you not even click claim. Clicking OK claims the rewards. That's weird. That's just a weird system. I always say if it's not broken, don't fix it. We have seen for literally years and years and years this system of rewards. And I get that some people might be like, oh, here's Prof off getting real specific too specific just to make a video on this topic. No, I'm making this video because I've talked to people who are just as frustrated as me, but they don't have a YouTube channel. They don't get to vent into the, the nether sphere of this world. So I get to be their voice. Again, I don't do this for revenue. I don't do this to be safe. I do this to hopefully reflect the frustration of so many players who don't have my outreach. So 
I think Kabam needs to either change the limit of Elder's Marks Pronto or at least give us the option for the next time a buy occurs, which should be, what, next season, to be able to click not now to claim or just have it show up in the rewards and claim when we're ready. I was ready to do Battlegrounds matches win or lose for much of the night, not just to clear Elder's Marks, but also, I think most importantly, so that I was able to continue the special objective to have... Uh, the ability to to do something real exciting, and that's complete five victory track or gladiator circuit matches, win or lose, to do the third out of six. And I know the next ones get tough because you have to go from completing to winning and then completing to winning, and that's why I have so much respect for those of you that have won at least 16 Battlegrounds matches already this season. Like, that's just a ton, and it's really, really impressive. But at the same time, um, I'm taking my time, I guess. I don't know. Kabam, fix this. It's worse for the game. Thanks for watching.